Hey guys, Adriano Pesquetti from Wise Real Estate. Welcome again to my newest club main delay listing. This amazing double story, 42 square metric on built family home, only a couple of years old, 110 golf links drive in Beveridge. Like, share, tag someone in this post that may be interested. Come through guys, I want to show you this home. Let's go and check it out. So as we do always at the start, we, it's a beautiful, nice, low maintenance home. Uh, it's got some grass area, it's got a nice big driveway. Um, it's really, really clean and pristine. And you're actually uh, towards the end of Golfing Strive here uh, in the Club Mandalay Estate. I just wanna quickly show you just across the road. So there is going to be a park literally just across the road as well, uh, where you'll be able to play in, but there's plenty, plenty of um, uh, parks around this beautiful estate. Come through guys and let's go and check the home out. So the first thing that you'll see guys, it is a very expensive home, as I said. Spanning over two levels, it's 42 squares. You get a beautiful big entry hallway with these beautiful laminate timber floors that actually flow right through the downstairs areas of the home. The first thing that you'll see, however, in through this way, first room, is your the old traditional formal living. Now this area, along with the other living zone, which you'll see in a second, is carpeted as well as the bedrooms upstairs. Again, this is perfect. And again, lots of people don't use the formal living zone anymore, so this one could easily be either another bedroom downstairs if you're wanting a fifth, could be a home office, a kid's playroom, a study zone, multi-purpose room, but again, very good size. And the other beauty that you get is beautiful big windows and beautiful natural light, which I think is amazing. The other thing, obviously, that you'll see as you come through the entrance is these beautiful timber stairs, which take you upstairs to the sleeping quarters, but we're gonna wait for that a little bit. We're gonna keep coming through, guys. The second room, backing on, is the traditional theater room. Now, I will show you that there is sliding doors through here. So it is that traditional theater room. Um, nothing has been set up for the theater room. However, you could easily do that. And again, being that this is the second living zone downstairs, you could have this as a master, another bedroom as well and have that as a lounge room. Or again, you could have this as a kid's room, kid's retreat, a gaming room, very much a multi-purpose room, or set it up as a theater room. This is an inbuilt bench. The owner made this. This is actually gonna stay as part of. I'm gonna, again, just to give you a good feel and sense of space, and it's a very, very good size room. We're gonna keep coming through. Now, this is the downstairs powder room. So there's three toilets in this house. This is the downstairs powder room. So for those guests, I love it because it's simplistic, really nice light and white tones, beautiful uh, white tiles, which I think are amazing, just brightens up the place. C keeping coming through, through this side, you're going to find the laundry. Now, mind George's camera and whatnot in here. This is where the magic happens. Thanks, George, for just leaving this on the bench. <laughs> so as you can see, tying in with the um, theme of obviously the bathroom and whatnot, uh, the powder room downstairs, you've got a nice big uh, trough, big space for washer and dryer, and outside you've actually got access, low maintenance access actually, which takes you from the front with the side gate all the way through to the rear as well. If you're wanting to, as you can see here, a nice little basket area, which I think is really, really cool. So that's obviously been built in by the owners, which is great. You've got storage through here, and one thing this does, this house does have, is epics, an epic amount of storage just to swivel around this way, where you see more storage, so that's walk-in storage, which again is amazing. Now, this is your third living zone. So this is the traditional big space, and this is what you're buying, guys. This is what lifestyle is all about in Mandalay, a massive downstairs entertaining zone. Every room in this house is huge. We always start in the kitchen. The first thing that you see that catches your eye Beautiful pendant lights, so these are brand new, just, the owners have just put them in, which I think is amazing. And this massive 40 mil stone waterfall, big, 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 big island bench. The one thing that the owners have done, which I think is amazing, is they've actually added cupboard space on both sides of the bench, which I think is great. Plus you've got the breakfast bar as well, and it's a fully dedicated bench. So no sink, or anything like that, fully dedicated on bench. You've got plenty of cupboards all the way across, which is amazing. You've got this beautiful big other side of the kitchen here. Now there's 20 mil on this side, 20 mil Caesar stone, but that beautiful massive window, so much natural light in this house is amazing. You've got that beautiful big 
uh, 90 mil or 900 millimeter gas cooktop cooker and oven, which is all in one, which again, perfect for those chefs. And you've got that beautiful two-tone effect that ties in, so you've got the light and dark. And again, this, as I said, the cupboard space in, and storage space in this home is magnificent. And then when you thought the kitchen was big enough, well, there's actually more. Come through to your walk-in butlers. So as I said before, through the Olive Bench, no uh, washing at all there. The owners have done it in here so to make it a proper butler's pantry. So the sink's actually in here, which is great. Dishwasher, which is in here. Fridge space, big, big, big fridge space through there as well. And lots of pantry space and more cupboard space on top and on the bottom. And this goes through to the double car garage, which is fully loaded. We're not gonna show you that because there's a little bit going on. So obviously the owners have done a big, big declutter through there, but that is your access through to your double garage. We're gonna flip around and the dining zone through here. So this is a, again, I don't know whether you can, whether the picture will actually show, do it justice, but as I said, again, for the third time, massive rooms and this dining zone is actually really starts from about here, goes all the way to here. So this zone, big table, you could go big square table, you could go big round table, you could even fit two of these tables back to back to actually have a massive zone. But again, perfect dining zone. This obviously flows outside. Again, lots of natural light, as you can see. So downstairs, just quickly, is fitted with ducted heating and there's actually this big Panasonic split system downstairs. Um, upstairs, there's the VAP cooling system, which you'll see in a bit. Through this side, guys, yes, bear with me, there's a lot to see in this house. Massive open plan lounge room. The modern lounge room, again, it's, this space is huge. I don't know if you can do justice on the lens, but once you come through this home, you'll see Everything is massive. Big windows again, big block out blind. Oh, this one's a sun blind, I should say, downstairs. Again, inbuilt um, cabinetry. And this is obviously the, um, this is the Braemar system, as you can see there. We're gonna go outside. We're gonna do a little bit differently. We're gonna finish off upstairs because I really want you to see this amazing outdoor entertaining zone. Have a look at this slice of tranquility. It feels like you're actually on holidays this zone when you come over here. So you've got this big covered alfresco zone, nice big table just to show you the space. And that flows on from your, so this is stacker door. So it's a triple stacker door on this side and, and single stacker door on here. So it just makes, not like you'd need it, but it makes your indoor even bigger. The concrete has just been freshly done, been freshly painted as well, and it's low maintenance. So that's the side gate from the front and the laundry just here, but you've got full side access up here. You've got a paved barbecue zone over here. So this is obviously where the owners cook the barbecue and you've got an awesome built bar. So again, it gives you multiple areas outside perfect for entertaining. So you've got covered and uncovered, which is great. If you wanted to cover this, you could, but again, it's beautiful timber deck, nice bar section, which is amazing, perfect for entertaining. I'll give you the full, I'll give you the full tour, guys. So this is me behind the bar, serving some drinks for family and friends. Um, again, it's very low maintenance out here. Um, so all this area is paved. And you've also got another area um, just as a lounge sunbake section if you want, which again is amazing. You've got nice grass area, so this grass is relatively new, so it's still trying to pick up. You've also got a storage shed there for the fellas out there. It is fully decked out, so you can chuck all your garden stuff and whatnot inside, tool shed through there. And you get the flow on effect through here, so it's all very low maintenance paved, goes all the way up through, and that's access through to the garage there. So it is a perfect entertainer's house with the amount of living zones that it has and the uh, outdoor entertaining zone that it does sort of facilitate a very big family, perfect for parties. So that's downstairs, guys. Um, as I said, there's three living zones downstairs. Now, all the bedrooms are upstairs in this home uh, and there is another big, big living zone upstairs um, or rumpus for the kids. So 
We're gonna head on upstairs now. I'm gonna show you the rest of the home. So as you can see, coming up the stairs, you've got those beautiful dark timber floors, which I think is amazing. You've got this awesome rumpus area up here, perfect for the kids. So the kids can easily entertain their friends and look at the size of this space. So as I said, all carpet, nice, beautiful plush carpet. And amazing, big, amazing big space. Through here, we've just fitted new LED lights through here as well, just to give it that nice modern look. Flipping around through this way, we're gonna go through to the master. Study zone, okay? So if you didn't wanna use downstairs as a study or for the kids, you can easily fit two people to utilize that space as well, which is great. I've gotta show you this. This is of course the master. This is, now all the bedrooms are king bedrooms. This one is double king because it's huge. Have a look at the size of this room, guys. Big, big, big king bed. Big space on either side. Loads of natural light, which I think is amazing. And of course upstairs here, I don't know if you come in a little bit, George, but you get a nice view of all the back paddocks there. So that basically backs onto Mandalay Circuit. Down there, so you got beautiful views. Now through this way, this is like a little powder room or makeup area for the missus, the wives out there. Um, you could easily build this space out if you want to and make more cupboard space. Um, but the guys, uh, the owners have just um, set up like this. But again, it's a very multi-purpose space. You can use this as a, a home office or study. Through this way, we're gonna go through to the ensuite. Now, the ensuite bathroom, guys, is actually much bigger than the main bathroom, but they generally are in these houses. The first thing, obviously, you'll see is a beautiful double vanity, big, big mirror, and an amazing double shower. Look at the size of that recess, it's huge. Jules is doing some nifty camera work there. I like that, down on these knees so you can't see him. So again, massive, massive ensuite. You've got a separate toilet which is tucked around the corner there. It does come with a door, so you can do your business in private. And walk in. He's done a fantastic job there not to get on uh, camera. Massive, massive walk in. So if you didn't want, if you wanted more space, that other room on the other side of the bathroom, you could easily make into more uh, road space as well. But again, massive, massive space, double hanging, plenty of space up the top. Again, perfect. Master, now I'm gonna see how he's gonna do this. Oh, he's done it, he's done it, good. So that's the master, guys. Come through with me this way. We're gonna go check out the other three bedrooms upstairs. So again, zone, family zone. Bedroom number two. And as you can see when you come in, the bedrooms are all massive. They're king bedrooms. This is a queen bed. And the amount of space on the other side is insane. Each room can have their own study zone. As you can see, we've set that up. Still big enough space, and all the bedrooms actually have walk-ins. So when you think it's big, well, it's a bit more. So every bedroom you'll see has its own walk-in, which I think is amazing. Even enough to put a little chair. As you can see upstairs, it's fitted with the evap cooling, so evap cooling up here. And also you've got ducted heating, and they're all fitted, of course, multiple power points, and also coax for TVs. We're gonna go through there. So that is a separate toilet to the separate bathroom on this side. So you got your beautiful um, central bathroom. Again, not as big as the ensuite, although it is still a massive bathroom. The first thing, of course, you see is that beautiful bath all the way down the end, nice big deep bath, tiled fully around, which I think is amazing. It's a bit of a showpiece. Double vanity, which I think is amazing. Perfect for those big families. And again, a really good size shower. Look, look at that. It's almost a double shower, which is fantastic. And then you've got number bedroom three and four at the Buria. So this one, bedroom three, again, that's a queen bed. And just have a look how much space that you've actually got. Big, big, big rooms. Every room in this house is massive. Enough for a, a nice drawer set or desk area. You've got walk-in through here again. As you can see, another walk-in robe. And then more storage. Have a look at this, uh, you gotta, yeah, good. Have a look at this, ready? One, two, now this could be a room in itself. Have a look at that. Walk-in, which I think is amazing. 
big linen press. Again, you could utilize, if you don't need this all this storage, you could easily utilize this as take the doors off and have your study in, in between there, which you could do. And last but not least, bedroom number four. Again, massive bedroom, queen bed, very similar to across there. And you've got your walk-in through here. As you can see there, you've got your walk-in robe. And that's the home, guys. Uh, that, is, that is the home. Again, massive home, about to hit the market. It's gonna cater to a wide range of demographic. I'm standing under the cooler because it's a little bit warm today. George is sweating, I'm actually feeling all right now. Um, yeah, gonna cater to a massive range of family. It's only a few years old, Metricon 42 square home. Uh, again, every room is big. You could easily make this into a five or six bedroom house if you really want to. Um, and again, that downstairs zone, that living zone is perfect. That outdoor entertaining zone. You're only up the road from Club Mandalay where you get all the access to all the facilities, award-winning golf course. Um, you get the gym, you get the outdoor pool, the tennis courts, the basketball courts. Very, very uh, awesome family community here in Club Mandalay. I hope you enjoyed the tour. As I said initially, like this post, share it to your family and friends, tag someone in it that may be interested in it. I know this tour went for a little bit longer, but again, there's so much to see um, in this fabulous house. Um, I hope it's impressive enough to come and check it out at one of our open homes. Alternatively, if you want information on this home or any other home, including your home, thinking that you may want to sell it in 2022, give me a call anytime, as always, uh, on 0402 055 Thanks, guys, for taking the time and enjoying this long tour. I hope it's impressive enough to come and check it out, and I look forward to meeting you at one of my open homes. Thanks.